It was a great result on Saturday against Maryland, something typical that our team's been all season, um, just kind of consistent in being able to play together as a team and uh, putting an effort in on both sides of the ball. And it was truly a team um, success in, in terms of just the, the victory and also um, clinching a share of the Big Ten. And as soon as I say share of the Big Ten, um, I told the players that we have some more work to do this week um, in preparation for Northwestern, which will be our final game in the Big Ten. Um, and it's important, I think, uh, for, these, for this team to kind of complete the journey that they've had since the beginning of the Big Ten. Um, and that means that we have to do all the right things in terms of recovering and preparing for Northwestern. Uh, I know it's uh, something that they will look forward to um, winning the title outright, um, but obviously it has a very challenging Northwestern in front of them who've done very well this year. So we're going to have to continue with what we've done with our preparation, but also with our effort and our focus um, to get that result, and then also having the opportunity to possibly host the Big Ten tournament in the upcoming weeks. So um, it's been an exciting journey with this group, but it is not even close to being over. What kind of focus or even sense of urgency do you feel with the senior class to keep this going as long as they can and keep the season alive? Well, I think anything, anytime you talk to a coach, um, you know, we, we talk about the experience that athletes have, and you want to keep providing that experience because those are memories they'll keep forever. You know, even on Saturday um, when they got their hats and their T-shirts, um, th those memories are something that they'll hold on to. And it's incredible the, uh, the selfie generation. I, don't, I can't imagine how many selfies I've seen taken in this amount of time. Like when I won it, it was like, here's, and then walked away, basically. But, um, I, you know, those memories you want for them, and that's what you want from their experience here at Wisconsin. Um, and to let them know that they've created that. And what I feel confident with right now is that those seniors will make sure that whatever happens, they're, they're going to put their best effort forward. And that's all you can ask for from, from your team and from players. You warned us last week that Maryland was going to be tough. So it's 70 minutes into the game, 75, and there's no score. What was going through your mind? Oh, no. Um, you know, we've been in this position a lot. Um, and... I think the players have a confidence about them that it's going to happen with the work rate that they've had. Um, but what we've talked about is somebody has to be special, you know, and, you know, it was Michaela this time. But also on the other side, you know, defensively, you had to shut down some of their, their problems and their issues, Alex Anthony especially. Um, but I, you just, there's a belief now. And as a coach, there's that belief um, is something that you can't coach. Uh, it's experience that they have. And so um, I, I wasn't, I wasn't as, as worried as um, people would think because it's the game of soccer, right? It comes down to those moments. So um, it was a little bit of a little gray hair, but um, happy that, that it ended the way it did.